In the human world, we can say things like, pick on someone your own size, but in the animal kingdom, it's fair game. If one animal can bring it down, no matter the size, they'll probably go for the kill. And the win can come from the most unexpected of creatures. We have carefully picked the most astonishing videos that'll make you say, damn nature, you scary. Oh. Oh. From two beasts knocking each other out with a single blow, to the tallest animal in the savanna fending away the most dangerous predator, here are 20 times animals messed with the wrong opponent. Number 20. Rabbit vs. Snake – Mama Rabbit Saves Babies It's no secret that predatory snakes love to eat bunnies, especially if the bunnies are babies. But this huge black snake messed with the wrong mama. When we think of rabbits, we tend to think about a fluffy and adorable creature incapable of doing any harm to anybody. Rabbits are often associated with innocence, childhood, and sweetness. But if a mother rabbit feels that her baby is in danger, you'll get to see just how badass rabbits can actually be. This snake noticed a family of rabbits, and as you know, babies are always an easy prey. But this snake clearly underestimated the mother in this case. The snake has the upper hand for a while there. The bunny looks like she's losing the battle. But in a gesture as fast as a lightning strike, she frees herself from the snake's deadly embrace and starts, quite literally, kicking its butt. The predator quickly understands the huge mistake it made and tries to flee for its life. But mama ain't done yet. She keeps coming back for more, not letting the snake escape. Before we go on, like this video, smash the subscribe button, and click the notification bell right now, or this centipede will crawl on your face when you're sleeping. Number 19. Lion vs. Mongoose. Mongoose fends off four lions. Mongooses might be small and cute, but I would not recommend getting in their way. They can be extremely vicious and aggressive. Take a look at this video, for example. There are not one, not two, but four adult lionesses in a dramatic face down with a very feisty mongoose. This video comes from the Maasai Mara National Park in southern Kenya. The mongoose is a small fraction of the size of either one of the lionesses, so at first glance, you could perfectly well assume that the mongoose is being reckless and unreasonable, because the lions are probably going to win this battle. But in reality, mongooses are so extremely combative and hostile that all the other animals, no matter their size, are terrified of them. It becomes apparent that the little furry creature has no intention whatsoever of becoming a lion's lunch. Quite the contrary. I don't think that this particular pride is going to go anywhere near the mongoose's territory anytime soon. The brave little mongoose even attacks one of the lions at one point. The surprise created by such an act of fearlessness buys the mongoose enough time to escape to a nearby hole in the ground. But rather than staying safely beneath the surface, the mongoose re-emerges even more determined to take the fight to the lions. Number 18. Lion fails to catch gazelle in epic safari footage. People don't often realize just how fast and how reactive their reflexes actually are. It's normal that an animal species that is prey for so many predators has evolved into being such an expert with getting away as efficiently as possible. And the gazelle is no exception. Look at this beautiful and delicate gazelle drinking water at a waterhole situated at the center of Serengeti National Park. The animal was alone, therefore it was particularly alert. You know, you never know what's lurking in the tall grass. Suddenly, and seemingly out of nowhere, a lion appears and tries to ambush the gazelle. The predator basically corners the prey in a way that the gazelle should try to escape by running to the left of the frame. Luckily, gazelles are quick on their feet, literally and figuratively. So in a surprising turn of events, the gazelle performs an incredible juke move and manages to go in a totally different direction. The lion, thinking the gazelle would go in the same direction as her, keeps running straight in front of her without realizing the gazelle played her for a fool. Rumor has it, the lioness is still running to this day. Number 17. Mother saves baby zebra from lion attack. Brutal kick. 
This video also comes to us from the Masao Mara National Reserve in Kenya, and it shows a mama zebra risking her own life to scare a fierce lioness off. The dramatic battle broke out right after a pretty intimidating stampede of zebras and buffaloes fled in utter fear after being crept up on by the predator. But unfortunately, one little zebra foal was not able to escape from the scene fast enough and, of course, fell victim to the majestic big cat. But this lioness was not expecting the reaction of its brave mother and her strong instinct of protecting her baby. The predator had the foal under her control and she was about to start sinking her fangs into the young zebra. The foal was squealing in pain, completely terrified. But at that age, and against such a skilled predator, there was nothing the little zebra could do. But no worries. Mama was determined to save her young one from the lioness. She starts headbutting the big cat over and over until she needs to let go of the baby. Then, both mother and child start running as fast as they possibly can to get away. The lioness, completely baffled, needs a few seconds to understand what just happened. Number 16. Gang of orcas paralyze a tiger shark before ripping it to pieces. Orcas have had a very bad reputation for so long that now people have preconceived ideas about what kind of animal they actually are. We even gave them the nickname Killer Whales. And although it is true that orcas are extremely skilled predators, it doesn't mean they're actually evil. But that's not to say they're harmless either, and if you ever see an orca in the water, the best thing to do would be to get out of there as fast as humanly possible. In this amazing footage, you can see a pod of orcas hunting and killing a tiger shark. For those who don't know, tiger sharks are one of the most aggressive and deadly sharks out there, so taking one down is no joke. The three orcas are working as a team, swimming repeatedly around and below the shark, trapping it against the surface. Eventually, the orcas have enough playtime and they go for their big move. They flip the shark onto its back, which induces a state of paralysis known as tonic immobility. After that, all they have to do is take turns at eating and stripping the seven-foot tiger shark. Orcas are so incredibly intelligent. Number 15. Sleeping walruses scaring mother polar bear off. So walruses are ginormous, and I mean it. An adult male walrus can easily tip the scales at 3,700 pounds. It's fair to say they are not to be messed with. But this polar bear mom and her young cub are desperate for food, and desperate times call for desperate measures, as they say. The bear would never try anything with the gigantic walruses, but you can see how skinny she and her cub are. Their skin is hanging loose. If they go without food for much longer, they may not make it. This video was taken in Norway's Svalbard archipelago, far north of the Arctic Circle. It was late July, and mother and child were traveling through Hinlopen Strait, just west of the large island Spitsbergen. This route would be impossible to make most summers when ice blocks the passage. But that summer, there was almost no ice, making hunting a lot harder for the polar bears, hence their poor condition. The mother sniffs the air and picks up the scent of the enormous walrus. Now, she knows that she evidently cannot take a fully grown, healthy adult walrus. A carcass would solve all their problems, maybe even a very old or very sick walrus. But as it turned out, that wasn't the case. That walrus was alive and well, so the search for food had to continue for the two polar bears. Number 14. Sea Lion Hunting and Eating a Large Octopus Sea lions are not known to be violent, but they are nonetheless excellent hunters. They are quite chunky and seemingly clumsy, but the instant they enter the ocean, they turn into voracious predators. This amazing footage is the world's first time that we see one of these amazing animals in action through their own point of view. National Geographic literally put a camera on a female sea lion's back, and this is what came of it. She goes into the water in hopes of finding some food, and shortly after, she spots an octopus. She instantly launches an attack. She manages to get her mouth on her prey, but that first bite didn't seem to do the trick, so she decides to drive her victim into the surface so she can eat and also breathe. But the octopus seems to get away. The invertebrate releases a face full of ink to confuse and disorient its attacker, but to no avail. The sea lion keeps coming. She dismantles the octopus bite after bite, each time taking a tentacle with her. 
This method may seem very cruel, but it's undeniable that it's also extremely effective. With no tentacles, the octopus can't swim away. When the huntress is done eating, she goes back to the beach to have a little nap under the sun. Number 13. Number 12. Giant Moray Eel Attacks Venomous Stonefish Stonefish are the most venomous fish in the ocean. Their lethal venom is stored in the dorsal fin spines. They contain a proteinaceous toxin called verrucotoxin. When stung, the victim of the stonefish will experience intense pain, respiratory weakness, damage to the cardiovascular system, convulsions and paralysis, and eventually death. So this fish is not to be messed around with, if you know what I mean. In other words, a predator most certainly should think twice before approaching this little killer. But the giant moray eel is too badass for any of that. They're capable of reaching 10 feet in length, and they weigh around 66 pounds. And most importantly, the terribly lethal venom of the stonefish appears to have little to no effect on them. Which, yeah, that's an advantage for sure. I mean, considering that stonefish have just the one means of defending themselves, if the eel is immune to its venom, the fish is just the easiest prey in the world for the menacing looking eel. In this incredible footage, you can see a stonefish hanging out by the rocks and blending in, which is how they spend most of their time, hence their name. When suddenly, a giant moray eel simply picks it up like nothing and starts eating away at it. Uh, nature's scary sometimes. Number 11. Crazy Cockerel Attacks Cows Young roosters are known for being a little bit aggressive when they go through sexual maturity, but this one may just take the cake. This one decided to take on an entire herd of cows on its own. The cows seem very curious about the little feathery creature at first, but when the testosterone-fueled little rooster decides to start pecking violently into their heads, that's when they realize his vibes are not so chilled after all. The cockerel, very proud of his achievement, decides to celebrate his victory with a loud crow. Roosters start showing this kind of behavior at about five months old, and as much as it can be a little annoying to the rest of the farm animals that have to coexist with them, it remains a very important step in their lives. This chicken is particularly feisty, though. Cows are not aggressive in nature whatsoever, but they are still incredibly bigger than the little bird. The large herd is left in a daze. They don't understand why their friend attacked them for no good reason. Number 10. Chimp vs. Raccoon This bizarre incident occurred at the St. Louis Zoo. A raccoon had the misfortune of venturing inside the chimp's enclosure, and boy was that a huge mistake. Chimps are very complex creatures, and they can sometimes show some cruel traits. When they realize that there's an intruder in their territory, they all come together to trap it. The first one gets a hold of the raccoon's tail and throws the poor animal towards the fence of the enclosure. The unfortunate rodent is left being very confused because of the hit he just took. He seems disoriented and quite weakened. He desperately tries to escape through the same drain hole he came in there in the first place, but another chimp grabs it by the tail once again and pulls it back. This happens several times. It's almost like the apes are playing some kind of sadistic game with the unlucky raccoon. They're not showing any signs of wanting to eat the creature either. Maybe they're just showing off the fact that they have opposable thumbs so they can grab stuff with their hands. Or maybe they're simply bored. I mean, life in a zoo cage is not that exciting after all, and an intruder is a big event for them. Number 9. Otter Revenge – The Day the Monkeys Went Too Far and now for another crazy video from a zoo. This video right here was shot at the Bronx Zoo in New York in what appears to be the Jungle World exhibit, which had both Asian small clawed otters and Javan Lutung monkeys. Javan Lutungs, also referred to as ebony leaf monkeys, are a very delicate species native to eastern Java, hence their name. Apparently, the war between these two species is a long and bloody one. In this video, you can see how two monkeys are trying to mess with one of the otters, poking it and doing annoying things to it. At first, it just seems like some animal bullying, but things got pretty dark pretty fast. The monkeys start biting at the poor otter and trying to drag it out of the water. The otter is defenseless against the group of monkeys, and the harassment continues. Evidently, the otters had enough of the unfair treatment they were getting, and one day they decided to work all together as a team and drown a monkey to death. This could almost be like a scene out of an Italian gangster movie. Number 8. 
Zebra knocks out Wildebeest with a single kick. In this footage, you can see lots of different animal species gathering around a watering hole in the savanna. All of the animals here are actually herbivores, which means they are not a threat to each other. That explains the fact that they all seem quite relaxed, like a group of friends chilling around a swimming pool. But halfway through the video, some tension starts rising, and all the creatures seem to be a little bit on edge. Maybe they caught the scent of a predator, or maybe there are too many animals for one small watering hole. At one point, one of the zebras delivers a very nasty-looking back kick to one of the blue wildebeest. The sudden gesture of the kick scared away all the other animals, and when the herd dissipates, you can see the poor wildebeest passed out on the ground. The kick was so strong, it actually knocked it out cold. Thankfully, the poor creature woke up later on, but it was a little shaky for a while. Who knew that zebras packed such a powerful kick? Number 7. Mother Bear Fights Tiger to Save Her Cub So, bears are pretty big and strong and scary as it is, but a mama bear trying to protect her cub? That is just some next level stuff. And this video is the perfect example of the bear's infallible mother instincts. This gem was posted on the Nat Geo Wild YouTube page, and it shows a sloth bear battling a massive tiger to keep her baby safe at the Tadoba National Park in India. This incident took place during the harsh summer months, when in the park, temperatures reach insanely high levels. The extreme heat and the scarcity of water leads animals to gather around common water holes, and this can create a lot of animosity. This is one of the examples of a vicious encounter created by the hard weather conditions. Mama Sloth Bear and her cub were approaching the watering hole at the same time that the tiger was drinking. The second the tiger sees them, it immediately charges the adult bear. But Mommy is not having it today, not if it's going to put her young one in danger. They fight for about 15 minutes, and in the aftermath, both animals sustained considerable injuries. But the cub was safe and sound after all. Number 6. Ram vs. Bull Rams are pretty metal animals. I mean, they literally fight by rearing up on their hind legs and then slamming their heads into each other until one of them is too dazed to go on. That sounds terrifying if you think about it. Because they seem to do this all the time, their skulls and necks have evolved in such a way that they are able to take the substantial abuse of their ways. Bulls, on the other hand, also butt heads together, and they also occasionally gore with their strong and pointy horns. Although bulls mostly fight by a sort of locked horns wrestling, their size is considerably larger than the rams. So who do you think would win in a face down? Let's check it out. In this video, a ram and a bull seem to go at it, each in its specific way. And what do you know? After only one round, both animals are knocked out on the ground. It's clear that the ram's technique is incredibly powerful. It's not easy to knock such a massive bull with just one hit. But if the bull manages to stand up and decides to gore the ram in the stomach, it would be game over for the little one. Number 5. Yellow Mongoose versus Cape Cobra Mongooses are small, cute even, but don't let that fool you. They are extremely vicious predators, and they usually appear to have a very nasty and bad temper. In other words, they are tiny, but they are very, very aggressive. And their favorite meal is cobras. But how can they hunt a cobra without being bitten and dying instantly? Well, you see, mongooses are immune to the cobra's venom, so yeah, that helps. That means that usually when a cobra sees a mongoose, it will try by any means possible to hide or escape far away. But to every rule, there is an exception, and this is the one. This cape cobra was having a little nap under some garden furniture, and the mongoose was obviously looking for prey. And when it catches the serpent's scent, it's game on. There's no way for the cobra to escape. She is trapped. But this one is not giving up. It tries to bite over and over again at the pesky predator. Several bites will not kill it, but it definitely would slow it down. And that can be very dangerous for the mongoose. The cobra does not back down, even after they take the fight out the back. They keep going at each other for quite a while, until the mongoose realizes this serpent is too much hassle, and so it goes back to its burrow, defeated. Number 4. Electric Fence vs. Goat This video is not about two animals having a go at each other, but rather a poor goat having a face down with an electric fence. 
This poor little creature evidently never had the misfortune of encountering an electric fence before. If you look closely, the fence looks brand new. The goat's owner probably just put it up before this video was taken. So the animal, being a little curious, is investigating the new addition to his home. Keep in mind that this seemingly harmless fence actually packs a whopping 5,000 volts electric current, which by all means would give anyone the shakes and a big fat scare. So the goat is getting closer and closer, and when its nose finally touches the wire, it jumps straight back and screams in painful surprise. One thing's for sure, I doubt this goat is ever gonna get anywhere near that fence ever again. So if you have a mischievous escape artist of a goat, you know what to do. Some people might say this is too much, that there's no need to hurt the goat like this. But keep in mind, electric fences also keep the predators away from your farm animals as much as they keep them from running away. Number 3. Giraffe Kicks Lion to Defend Itself Giraffes are more dangerous than they look. Sure, they're cute with their little rounded horns and their comically long necks, but I would not piss off a giraffe. If they can scare away an entire pride of lions, it means they can hold their own just fine. Check out this cool video of a solitary giraffe being surrounded by a pride of lions. At first, you think this poor giraffe is going to become yummy lunch, but keep watching. Just like horses do, giraffes can kick pretty hard with their hind legs, so much so that these lions can get seriously injured. And they know that, so they proceed with the utmost care and caution. They know that they can risk death if they are too reckless. The giraffe doesn't seem very worried, because it probably has done the same thing many times before. But the lioness's tactic is to exhaust the giraffe and finish the business after dark. Lions have excellent night vision. On the other hand, giraffes do not. But in this case, it looks like the giraffe is getting away with it. Number 2. Underestimating a penguin is a mistake that might cost you dearly. Penguins have a reputation of being cute, little, funny, and somewhat ridiculous creatures. And sure, these flightless birds are super adorable. They always waddle about like fluffy, tiny little drunk toddlers. I mean, it's not for nothing that Hollywood cast Danny DeVito as their human equivalent. But underestimating a penguin has proven to be a fatal mistake. And if you don't believe me, just ask this hungry petrel what he thinks about it. Petrels are predatory giant birds, and this one was clearly planning on catching one of the emperor penguin chicks. But this group of chicks is old enough to leave their icy home for the first time. They are about to take the biggest and most crucial step in their lives. All the youngsters together have to head towards the sea, a place filled with dangerous predators, a place they've never been before, and they have to do so completely unsupervised. But the cold waters of Antarctica aren't the only place where fatal dangers might hide, and these cute baby penguins will soon find that out. Out of nowhere, a giant petrel appears, a predatory bird that special specializes in eating chicks. It is so much bigger than the younglings, and even if they try to flee as fast as possible, they're still quite clumsy, and keep in mind, penguins can't fly. One of the chicks is grabbed by its neck feathers, but the others are not ready to let down their friend in peril. So they all form a protective circle, and they defiantly stand all together against the petrel. The situation quickly becomes a standoff. But then, out of nowhere, an Adelie penguin shows up to save the day, and it stands right between the petrel and the chicks. The petrel knows not to mess with Adelie penguins, as they are the feistiest penguins of them all. This is a wonderful case of penguin solidarity. Number 1. Brave Mother Chicken Protects Her Chicks we all know about the inherent instinctive abilities that mothers have to protect their young ones. And as it turns out, chickens are no exception. Although chickens don't have a lot of means of protecting themselves, when it comes to a mother trying to save her chicks, the possibilities are endless. Take a look at this amazing mama fighting against the almighty King Cobra to save her babies. She notices the snake's presence, but it's too late to flee. The snake has ambushed them into a corner. The mom gets very anxious. She compulsively walks back and forth in front of her chicks to position herself between the predator and her younglings. 
The snake keeps approaching, silently but deadly. Our little feathered hero decides to go down fighting, and she actually attacks the reptile head on. But the snake is not about to give up. A chance like this one is not easy to stumble upon. The chicken keeps the snake's attention on her to give enough time to her chicks to escape. And once they are all safe, she comes back to make sure the predator got the message. That's a brave mother right there. As you can see, nature is very surprising sometimes. The underdog sometimes actually wins, and it keeps the scales balanced. What about you? Do you root for the predator or the prey whenever you see a nature video? Tell us about it. Also, check out our other cool stuff showing up on screen right now. See you next time!